very good morning my friends how are you hope you guys are doing very well and welcome on this new live trading video from extreme trader this is Salah speaking so in today's session i'm gonna use the one minute and five minute time frames to scalp the gold but however first i wanted to share with you what's going on so far in the premium forex signals group of course there will be always ups and downs there will be always some bad days however there will be always another good days where we can recover and make some profits this is how forex works this is the forex market you cannot expect the profits every single day and as we can see thankfully yesterday we had really great day with at least two of the signals euro pound and euro cad have reached the take profit number two uh, however as part of being honest and transparent with everyone uh, tuesday was not really a good day we had some losses and pound jpy has reached the take profit number one but however also on monday look at that monday was actually a hundred percent full of profits all of the signals have reached at least take profit number one uh, euro aod has reached the take profit number two so monday was really great day that is how uh, the signals work that is what you can expect actually from extreme trader forex signals and thankfully we have received some really nice messages from the members and this guy here thankfully he said best signals ever thank you there is also another message that we have received here um if i'm not mistaken this was received on monday this guy here he have made uh, 50 dollars in just the first day so as i said before forex has ups and downs however in general we are managing to finish every week in profit even though sometimes it's a uh, little but as i said before the november and december are one of the hardest months to trade forex but still we are doing well and for that i'm very proud so in the end if you wish to join extreme trader forex signals group please contact our support you can find their contact details in the description below this video contact them today and hopefully we will see you there all right so let's now begin the live trading session and sadly the signal that i have sent for the gold didn't really work and unfortunately the market did not reverse as i have expected on the previous resistance and the market kept pushing uh, going down and as we can see this candle right here um this candle right here has actually made the confirmation that the market seems like it's going to continue the fall so uh, it's normal my friends however if we look at the other signals uh, euro usd has reversed exactly from the edge of the safe uh, from the safe zone um pound usd still ranging however the pair has entered the safe zone and then went in 42 pips of profit aud usd has actually reversed near near to the entry point just i think well, maybe barely five pips only and then went all the way to the take profit level usd cad is still ranging at the entry point usd jpy is still exactly at the level where i have mentioned that it might actually uh, reverse and fall uh usd chf is still ranging in the safe zone so i admit that the midweek analysis didn't uh, work very well this month uh, this week but sadly but sorry but thankfully i mean thankfully the weekly analysis itself on saturday was very good so as i said before guys uh december is not really so easy to trade and it's expected these things uh can happen it doesn't mean of course that i'm a bad trader it doesn't mean of course that i don't know how to analyze the market these things happen to every trader in the world you will never find a trader never never you will never find a trader who can get 100 percent correct uh predictions every week so anyway before we explain this strategy or sorry before we go to the live trading i have to make sure that everyone have seen the video where i have explained this this strategy uh, just give me a, mom a moment please so this is my channel on youtube and if you wish guys to see the strategy i'm about to use today please scroll down in my channel until you find that video let me see if i can find it as well yes this one new forex strategy scalping gold on one minute candles this will explain to you in brief how to use the strategy i'm about to use right now in front of you and also you can follow it later by this video about scalping gold on this is another live trading video where i have actually uh used the same strategy on gold and there is also another video which is right here uh live trading scalping gold uh on the one minute time frame as well so you can actually use the, these three videos to understand very well what I'm about to use in this video so it will be clear for you. So first of all, uh, since my account today is 1,638 and I'm hoping to reach, um, let's say, 1,900 or $2,000 uh, this day, I, I hope so. Uh, however, 
let me just change the um, the lot size to make a 040 and okay now looking at the four hour time frame on the gold we can understand that the pair right now is actually uh, going up because let me just show you right now we are actually on a support level if I zoom in like that we can see that the candle is now reversing so in the general the candle is going to be a bullish candle because we are facing right now here a strong support and what we can see right here is at least th let me show you i need to zoom in so this reversal right here that's indicate at a support number one this support right here support number one so right here now the candle is reversing at support number two so all in all i need to go now back to the one minute time frame and look for the buy opportunities so let's go now to the one minute time frame zoom out like that zoom out as maximum as possible because we don't really care to any price action when we talk about the one minute time frame price action means nothing absolutely zero now what we need to like what we need to find is the strongest support and resistance levels not just any support or resistance we need to look at the strongest support and resistance levels what we can see right here that in the past we had this strong key resistance level that the market has actually made a strong a strong bearish reversal once it has hit that res uh, the pre previous uh, resistance level that means this is res uh, this resistance is strong and i'm gonna rely on it on my next trades because we can see right here that this is the very same level of the resistance has also become a support look at that the pair right now is exactly on the same level and i'm going to place the buy order exactly exactly look at that it happened right front of you very quickly i was just explaining to you okay let me just continue so the same level of the resistance has become right here a new support level therefore we can see right here that the pair has actually made a bullish reverse uh, bullish breakout from that previous support let me just now zoom in to show you so we can see it this one here we can see right here the pair has actually made this bullish uh, bullish breakout candle and right now look at that maybe you'll tell me now that this a lot this is a price action indicating a bearish reversal meaning right now the market is gonna fall i'm telling you guys you are on the one minute time frame one minute time frame really doesn't mean anything at all regarding candles or price actions uh, or patterns it doesn't mean anything the market is going to continue to rise definitely and let's see what will gonna happen now regarding the if the trade went in wrong what are we going to do if the trade went wrong we need now to look at the other chances to expect another reversal now since i have started my trade analyzing that this was right here a strong resistance we need to look now at the next strong resistance the next strong resistance is this one and as we can see the market has actually reversed almost each time it has reached that resistance uh, sorry that previous resistance and became a new support look at that the trade right now in the profit the trade right now going into profit let's zoom in and as you can see we are right now running in four pips of profit so i'm telling you really guys on the one minute time frame it doesn't really matter at all what kind of price action you are seeing it doesn't really matter that's why i'm zooming out like that because i just want to see the strongest support and resistance levels someone might tell me but salah why don't you just go to the 30 minute time frame for example and you can find that this was a strong resistance or a support the answer is 30 minute time frame doesn't really showing me anything i want it's not really showing me the strongest support and resistance levels as i as i'm planning to see uh one minute time frame actually can give me much better and clear uh, image about uh, the market and i have used this strategy for quite a long time and definitely yes I don't want to change it. I don't want to, to add any more rules. I thought about adding moving average or MACD or any, any indicator to this strategy. But however, I just feel very comfortable using my own methods on this strategy. Anyway, the trade right now going in the profit. And we're going to aim at least, let's see, let's see. So we can aim at least, my friends, uh, for the candle to hit the next uh, resistance, the, the previous resistance right here. So that's going to be actually my take profit level. Remember, we are just scalping. So I'm going to make the same as a stop loss or almost the same. 
just similar to it and we can expect from this trade i, th I think 10 pips only 11 pips it's okay as i said before we are just scalping the gold and we will be looking for different uh, also for another uh, trades soon so let me know please pause the recording and i'll be back to you later once this trade finish and as we can see the gold is rising still rising as i said my friends on the four hour time frame we analyzed it that it's gonna rise it has reversed from the support level and created support number two so of course it's gonna continue the rise no this time i'm gonna wait for it to hit the take profit number uh, the take profit i'm not gonna uh, stop it manually uh, it definitely it's gonna hit the take profit and it's gonna continue to rise actually you know something i'm thinking to increase the take profit level to be, to be that resistance right here on uh, 1839 but i think maybe better not to be so greedy uh since my target is today to to get this account to a thousand nine hundred or two thousand if i can however let's see what will gonna happen i'm gonna wait for this candle to just rise for another two pips is it really worth it i think it will close my, my, automatically yes it will hit the take profit level and of course it hit the take profit and the trade is still rising so now what's next as I said, we are still expecting from the pair to continue the rise. Now, the candle is rising and actually have made the breakout from that previous resistance. You remember that resistance I just talked about for a long time? The candle has already rose above the resistance. So now what we need to do, we need to go along with the candle and start to mark our levels where we can expect the candle to continue the rise again. Now, let's look at the right right here. We can see right here we had support number one and support number two so we are having these strong supports levels these two are supports levels right now look at that now we are having right here a resistance and the candle most likely is gonna actually reverse respecting that resistance however uh, the bullish momentum seem, seems stronger look at that look at that look at that look at the candle is falling yes yes more as I, I, ju I just told you it's gonna respect that resistance and it's gonna fall to that previous support level i have mentioned and I'm gonna place another buy. I'm gonna place another buy. Oh, shit, man. It, uh, it was. I was late. I was late. I actually wanted to place the buy order exactly on the same level of that previous support right here and right here. And the candle has actually reached there, but it reached that level. But sadly, it went up faster and it's just gonna continue the rise. That's really nice. That's really nice. So as we can see, look at that. This is where the candle actually has reached the previous support, as I mentioned. And right now it's going to continue the rise. So the question is where I should set my take profit level. Of course, it's going to continue the rise again until it hit that resistance right here. And I'm going to, of course, set almost the same as my stop loss. Now, is, it, is there a chance to lose the trade? Definitely, yes. Definitely, yes. I mean, to be honest. I'm just trying to be very honest as much as possible with everyone, with the followers and those who have just recently joined the channel. I have made losses using this strategy in the beginning, but I felt something that it has to be right. It has to be accurate. I mean, the strategy is not easy to apply. I'm telling you, you need experience. You need to have enough time in the market, especially in the gold, to know how the gold moving and you cannot just blindly use this strategy on any support or resistance levels you need to have experience long experience in the market to identify the strongest support and resistance levels look at that the candle right now is very close to the stop loss and there is a chance that i can actually lose the trade it's very possible the question is can you recover of course yes we can recover easily and i'm going to show you exactly how we can recover yes the candle now is going against my trade and i think it's going to hit the stop loss but thankfully i have made i think 40 dollars or 38 dollars actually guys i forgot uh, from the previous trade so let's see now what will gonna happen and let's see i'm just watching to see what will gonna happen and i think yes it's gonna hit the stop loss it's gonna hit it it's gonna hit it yes 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 it will hit the stop loss yes it hit the stop loss no problem we can always recover easily recover i'm gonna show you how we can easily recover let's go now back to the previous setup let's go to the strongest support level which the market has actually failed to break out from this one right here which was also previously a strong resistance right here and right here so most likely definitely the market right now is gonna continue the rise and this time i'm gonna 
uh, I have placed my buy order and this time I'm going to set the stop loss 31 pips below that support level because as I said before the market is going to continue to rise definitely it's just it's just sadly hit my previous stop loss and because I'm just scalping but now I'm not scalping anymore this is actually a uh, long-term trades or swing trading so right now I have set my take profit right here to be $98 uh, which is gonna uh, guarantee that I'm gonna recover the losses I have made from the previous trade plus the profit plus the new profits let me show you what will gonna happen right now as I said before I'm really depending on that resistance right here and this one right here and not only seeing them bluntly like that I'm depending on how strong they are because the market has actually made so many attempts right here to break out from these uh, previous resistance levels which have become a new support and the market actually uh, seems like it's going to be in a bullish momentum the the market is actually rising look at that if we draw here as a previous uh, sorry if we draw a support trend line we can see that the market actually is rising and i can just clone this uh, support trend line and we can see right here it's actually rising and if we do like that we can just see that the market is climbing look at that the market is climbing its way uh, towards the, re the strong resistance right here on 1850 anyway uh, we have to wait and see what will gonna happen allow me now please to pause the recording and i'll be back to you later to show you what will gonna happen with this trade as we can see my friends the trade is going well in the profit as i told you and it's almost there to hit the take profit level and right now we have covered already the losses from the previous trade <laughs> that is the beautiful thing about forex it's like a video game really if you understand it you can really enjoy making some profits and actually you can um stop getting nervous when you are losing a trade if you lose a trade you can easily recover on the next trade that's how forex works you can never expect i mean guys sadly this is what happens when someone hear about a new strategy he will go to the meta trader and he will test it once it fails for one time he will abandon it because he will think oh my god no man this strategy is not working i want a strategy that never fail i want a strategy that can give me 100 percent of profits i want to quit my job i want to completely rely on re rely on this strategy guys that is that is that doesn't exist i'm trying to explain on this channel that forex is a market that actually not everyone can trade it and even if you want to do to do that you have to have some patience and you have to understand that there will be some prof bad days for that you have to always be prepared so anyway that red right now is going in a profit of uh, 15 pips and i think it's going to continue to rise and it's going to hit the take profit level however let's see what will going to happen and 71 dollars of profit 73 i think that's it i don't want to be a greedy person and i don't want to teach anyone how to be greedy in my channel so anyway let me just explain to you how we can identify the strong support and resistance levels you can easily identify them by looking at what happened next in the future for example if we look at this pattern right here we can see that we have here a support level and here we have a support and here as well so which one of them is a strong or why this support level is a strong simply by the way look at that this shit thing is just <laughs> rising and i wish i kept it for hitting the take profit level it's all right so anyway what we need to explain here is the strongest support and resistance level let me show you this look at that look what will gonna happen if i align my support line in a way that it touches the support levels right here see what happened next that previous resist uh, sorry but that previous support level has become right here a strong resistance and right after the breakout from that previous resistance the market has become a new support now later on what happened is that mark that same level the same level of the support right here and became here a resistance and here a support has already become right here also another resistance that tells you that this level right here 1839 is a very strong that's a very strong level that's the kind of support and resistance you want to look for look at that look at that, the candle look at the candle how it's rising as i told you my friends on the four hour time frame it says that uh, oh sorry we can see that the market is going to continue to rise and therefore we can see the candle has actually made the breakout from that previous support now what we're gonna sorry from the previous resistance sorry now what is the next move 
Are we going to blindly keep buying and buying and buying and buying and buying? No, we cannot do that. That is not going to work. We have to have some uh, understanding. Look at that. Look at the candle right now. The candle is facing a strong resistance right here. As you can see, this resistance right here, the candle is facing that resistance level. And therefore, I'm going to place sell order as simple as that because we have to understand how this market moves now as i said before that was a strong support level and it was a strong resistance and also a strong support level so definitely the market is not simply gonna break out from the level immediately of course it has to make some reversal it may, it has to, to retest the broken support level and after that it's gonna continue the rise as you can see i'm just trying to make every single pip from the gold look at that the gold is falling as i have predicted that resistance can never be ignored and the pair right now is falling and then we have to make sure that we will exit with a small profits because as i said uh, the bullish momentum is strong and i'm just trading the pullback and i'm trying to reach the account 2700 then i'm gonna close the trade 1700 yes 1700 that's it guys <laughs> really if you can if you can just sculpt using my system you can really make some really good profits i mean in just uh, 19 minutes i think i have made about 80 dollars profit from uh, sculpting the gold and in general i think that's gonna be enough i mean i just wanted to share with you quickly this session that i have made while sculpting the gold and i highly advise everyone um to use the same strategy and also i wanted to share with you that if you are getting the knowledge if you are learning if you are making profits from uh, my channel and from my knowledge please support the channel by opening account in ic markets using the link provided in the description below this video um trust me in ic markets you will have the best uh, trading experience and it is actually um it's actually directed to the scalpers if you're gonna if you want to use my strategy and the way i'm scalp i'm scalping in forex i highly recommend for you to use ic markets and i would really i think it's just kind of appreciation if you have learned uh something from my channel so in the end i think that is enough and i don't want to make the, the, the video so long that's enough i think and i'm gonna stop that scalping right now and i'm gonna continue trading after about one hour so in the end i hope that was informative to you and i would like to thank you for watching